All right. Hey there, Dom. How you doing? Oh, hey, Eric. How are you? Hey, man, I I'm doing well enjoying this uh, winter, kind of, in Pennsylvania. We are, we're like early spring, late fall. <laughs> it's Pretty kind of crazy. I'm, I'm digging mean, it, though. I'm digging it. Some, some parts of PA got snow, but I, we, we just had like kind of rain in the morning. What about you guys? We had rain all day yesterday, a little bit of uh, a little bit of mist this morning. It said 45, but there's like, there's a, a different climate between where I park at school and by the time I get up to the upper parking lot, it's about 10 degrees colder. <laughs> so my, my spring jacket, which was fine in the parking lot when I got out of my truck, was not good when I got up to do parking lot duty this morning. A little <laughs> chilly. Yeah, a little chilly. Well, you know, so much is going on. We just had Pete and C at Kalahari. It was amazing. There's so much to talk about, but we just don't have time to even like schedule that this week. Like We have no. so many things going on, so... Yeah, it's kind of wild, but I think we're we're here for a special reason. What do you think? I think so. I think we should get things rolling. So I think it's time for a special PACT pod. Let's hit it. All right. Welcome to a special edition of the PACT pod. My name is Eric Verno, the honor and privilege of being the vice president of PACT, and I'm joined with Dom Salvucci. I'm the Southwest Regional Director of PACT. And, and welcome this, oh, sorry, sir. Uh, I was gonna say, this is our 20th uh, PACT pod episode, and it technically should be 19, but we had our 19th at PNC. I, I felt like a pretty, very uh, successful live pod during the show. What do you think? Got a lot of good feedback, a lot of good feedback yeah. from everybody. Uh, just just sharpening it up and ready to present at ISTE this summer as well. So that'll be fun. I'm looking forward to that. All right. So tell us more about what we got going on, Dom. Well, we have the honor and privilege to introduce members of PACT to an amazing organization. Tech spelled with a Q. <laughs> T-E-Q. Um, through tech, we've partnered to provide a pre our premium members with Otis platform, the Otis platform, which is an asynchronous professional development platform. Who look at that guy doing his doing his homework. Yeah, we truly have the honor. Uh, we get to welcome Otis to the PST family tonight. And for that, one of the most important rules we have is when it's time to have deep conversation and intellectual conversation, you make sure you bring a very smart person to the room. Yes. And for that this evening, we have Lisa Wren, who is a customer success advocate for tech. She's going to be joining us to talk about what Otis has to offer. I think we're ready for it. So let's bring on the pod guest. And good evening, Lisa. Welcome to the pod. Hi, everyone. Thank you for having me. Hi, Lisa. That's awesome awesome Hi. to have you here. So we want to make sure we kick off with... Uh, couple just to, get, just to get to know you kind of questions. So um, at tech, specifically Otis, uh, mm. what is your role? So as a customer success advocate, it's my job to make sure that all the users of our platform, uh, including the whole PAECT family, will have uh, great success uh, accessing Otis and really getting the most out of this PD resource. Cool. What did you do before you worked with Otis? So my first um, introduction to ed tech was actually through a startup that did um, assistive technology. So that was my first intro, intro to ed tech at all. I had no idea that's what I wanted to do. Um, but I really, I love the customer success role. I like connecting teachers with solutions. So that's really where I've made my niche here. Uh, and it's brought me here to tech. That's awesome. That's, yeah. So that's now. It's a much needed, much needed uh, path, pathway. Yeah, it would be for real. That's one of those jobs when your teacher back in the day said, you know, you just don't know what you're going to do in life. I mean, they truly meant it for you. <laughs> definitely. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So one final question before we get to, to really get into the, the what everybody's so looking forward to with Otis. So if you could pick a superpower, what would it be? What is your superpower? 
So if we're going to say my professional superpower, it's going to be connecting uh, those teachers with the resources. I, my role, I kind of live at the cross section of sales and professional mm -hmm. development and developing uh, the platform in and of itself. So I like to connect people with the right people to talk to and really help them get the most out of everything. That is a fantastic skill to have. Yes, thank yeah. you. <laughs> yeah. And it's such a big push in education, even with like teachers, with their students, just the connections that are being made. Mm -hmm. And um, there's so much power through connection. So that's awesome. And even we have pillars that we talk about with PACT and connect is a huge pillar that we have. So fits right in with what we're, what we're, we're driving with as well. So that's sure. awesome. So we have you on tonight, not just as the success advocate, which is such a big role, uh, but to really demo and introduce us, Dom and I, myself, we're being, you know, let's, let's be a, a little selfish. We get a little, you know, first look at the different uh, platform, uh, but also just to let our members know, because all of our members are receiving this in their introductory email, the ability to watch and learn more about it from you. So we'll go ahead and pull your demo screen up and let you share and talk about uh, the Otis platform. Sure. All right, I could see my screen right there. So Otis for Educators, um, as Dom mentioned, it is an asynchronous resource for professional development. We do also offer live courses. Um, so let me just take you to where those live. We'll just do a quick overview of a couple spots on our platform that are sort of key to success. So our live courses are typically between 3 and 4 p.m. So you would be able to tune in just clicking into any one of these courses. We do have a live chat moderator as well, who's able to help you walk you through, uh, you know, any questions you have while that course runs live. But if you do miss it when it runs live, we do put it in the library for you so you can access that later on. So let me go ahead and we'll do a quick scroll of all the good stuff here in the library. I'll do that nice and slow for you, but we cover really everything there is within ed education technology. So we'll just go through here. We have over 850 courses. Um, they are good for your Act 48, so that's something to keep in mind. Our company does also uh, report all of that to the state, so that takes something off your plate as well. But we have quite a few categories here. We'll pop into social emotional, which is so important and very timely as of now. So any course with that little thumbs up, that's good for your Act 48. You could click into okay. any one of these. And everything that we have on our platform is made in house. So that, you know, that's another good thing to think about is that this is all available for you from us you can suggest things to us we're happy to throw it on a roadmap for you and uh you know just keep that keep that line of communication open but any one of those courses are good for your act 48. we also offer micro credentials so that's going to be nice long series of courses your deep dives Google is our most popular by far, but we also offer for Smart, Promethean, Microsoft, Apple, assistive technology, and 3D printing. So you get your deep dive courses with your micro credentials. I'll pop over to our skills center. These are your anti micro credentials. They're short and sweet, one to two minutes long. They answer one question. It's a little more accurate than searching on YouTube or Google. So this will give you uh, little quick answers to anything you're looking for ed tech wise. Um, and just to wrap up on a support feature that we really love to showcase our Ask Otis button. Um, so this will connect you to a member of our PD team. We're available Monday through Friday between eight and five. So you do have a PD professional at your fingertips to answer any questions you have in the classroom or um, anything to do with EdTech or Otis itself, you have that lifeline there. 
I feel like I'm walking a school through it. So do you guys have any questions for me? Anything else I could click into or chat about? Uh, I was no. gonna say you're doing a great job as you're going yeah. through it. Maybe maybe <laughs> clicking into one. Um sure. well, I guess one thing to add would be uh PACT will be adding our it's one part of the partnership. We will be putting in some of our content, some of our webinars we've done, things of that nature. Mm -hmm. We've done sketch noting with Sylvia. Um, Duckworth, we've done something with Tony Vincent. So we have some content that we'll be putting in as well that only PACT members will be able to get. So what we're seeing is kind of what the overarching of what mm -hmm. Otis has, but there'll be some special features that are just for our members. But would you be able to possibly go into maybe like an example, like going into a course and just seeing kind of how it's laid out? I, yeah. I love the calendar. I didn't know about the calendar. Yeah. That was big. Mm -hmm. um, in fact, that it's, yeah. you know, you can do the, like, the different programs and um, the time frame and things of that nature. It's really exciting. Exactly. Um, along with that, that custom content that you mentioned, so it'll live right in the library alongside our own videos and it'll okay. be available to PAECT members um, so that all of that good stuff will be able to be tracked right alongside our own courses. So you get that nice all in one feel and uh, you can also schedule those live course, those uh, custom content courses. You could schedule them on the calendar so everyone can tune in at the same time. So that's mm -hmm. another little feature that I'll be helping uh, the leadership with just to, you know, really hammer out. But let's awesome. pop into nice. into a nice digital citizenship course. I like how you have not just the tools, but you also have the the concepts that people can learn about, too. It's not just the technology. It's the, the ideas behind it. Exactly. Yeah. Um, our, a lot of our courses that have that blue banner on them, those are good for the frameworks. So those are going to be more more of the pedagogical side um, of that, the concepts, as you mentioned. But this is what one of our courses looks like. So I'll just I'll click so you can kind of see how that goes. Ooh. So this is just a little preview of the studio we have right upstairs mm -hmm. in our in our office. Um, so everything is very is going to be more professional looking than, as I mentioned, going on YouTube and trying to find something, uh, you know, how to utilize these tech tools or anything you're using in the classroom. So you get more of that professional feel and our PD team are former classroom teachers. So Adam here used to teach. Uh, he was state certified to teach. So they know how to utilize technology rather than just sell it to you and then show you how to push a button. So, you know, we really take that utilization uh, piece very seriously in RPD. So looking at the screen here, we have like this. So the video they'll play through kind of the information on the left hand side, looking through the chapters. Um, we got a quiz and then what's assignments and links. So anything that's associated with the video, we're going to link for you down here. So oh, you can see yeah. we have our slide nice. deck here. We have, um, we even have the, the FERPA here. We have, we have just a little bit of everything as well as related videos that you can go nice. to. So now the, the notes were you had up here, the ad notes. Yes. Those would be like, if, as I'm taking the course, I could type my notes and keep my notes right in with this course. I don't have to worry about finding them somewhere on my computer or on mm -hmm. a notebook somewhere in my house. Exactly. So uh, that was actually a really good suggestion by one of our one of our other schools that uh, we partner with, because when a regular user logs in and starts watching a video, if they click into another screen, it's going to pause. So it's very hard to take notes, uh, you know, unless you're doing it analog. But then we made a feature so you can add any of your notes here. As the video is playing, it all stays within one screen. So that is what that feature is for there. That's slick. Useful. Scroll back up. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and just to touch on another way that uh, admins can really use Otis to guide 
their teachers professional learning, we do have the ability to create playlists. Mm -hmm. So this is something admins can do on their own, or they could reach out to me. That's what I'm here for. I'm the rep for Pennsylvania. So I'm happy to put together a little curated list for administrators to share with uh, the members of the different regions, or we could share something for everyone, which I'm sure we're going to do with uh, once we start uploading that custom content, which I'm very excited to see. Yeah, that's awesome. Now, are yeah. all the courses uh, like uh, around a set time or are they vary? I know the, the micro credentials would be longer, mm -hmm. but the, uh, the other courses, how do they range in time? I'd say they, they pretty much live between 25 to 45 minutes, but we'll let you know right at the top of the video what it, how long it'll be all together so that includes all the count all the chapters that's an all-encompassing uh time time stamp there okay thank you yeah, yeah. no problem so, and as far as content goes just to cure i'm just curious on my own sure. uh, as far as adding content and stuff like that do you you said about how you have your own studio you're mm -hmm. pulling things in does that happen pretty regularly so that's everything you see on the calendar so that's as often as we're adding new content to the wow. platform so we add, we add probably, I'd say, between eight and ten courses a month. We do try to keep everything as up-to-date as possible um, as well. Okay. So, I, oh, yeah, so you're doing that with them, and then from there it'll get kind of stored in the back end. And then exactly. if you weren't able to make that live, you'll still be able to go back then later and, and go through it. Okay. Exactly. Awesome. We try to make everything as accessible to everyone. Uh, obviously, not everyone is going to be available during certain sure. time frames. Yeah. Very nice. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. I like, I'm looking at some of the um, topics you have up on the calendar. They're mm -hmm. interesting. Yes. We have, Very good. We have a couple things here and there. So you could see if March has, has a little more. We're a bit more packed in March. <laughs> Just a little bit more. Just a little bit, you know. Yeah. Well, in fact, in March, we happen to have seen this email. Couldn't have timed it better for today. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pull this in real quick. Sure. And a great friend of PACT, Rochelle Poth, is going to be talking about bringing STEM into every classroom and working through Otis. And so, you know, again, we couldn't have timed it. One of our, our featured members, uh, I guess she's in the western end of the PA, isn't she? There near southwest, you, right? southwestern member. Yeah, so doing a lot of great things, and they're having this on March second, Thursday. So, yeah, if you're seeing this ahead of time, or if you're on, you know, definitely would be. I recommend almost anything that Rochelle's running. So she does such an amazing yeah. job. So, she yeah, definitely knows her information. Yeah. So that's cool. So I guess you do reach out to pull other people in. It's not just your in-house people doing the PD. Yes. Yeah. That's yes. Neat. Yeah, we do have courses from. Um, Alice Keeler is a big one. Uh, Mandy Frolic had did a whole series on educator mental health, which was really, really popular. So we always, we always love to bring in our influencers, you know, just get a new perspective on some new topics. That's excellent. Yeah. Awesome. Well, I love it. I, I think it's going to be a, like, again, a great partnership. I believe if a, an individual would go to the Otis website mm -hmm. alone, um, and try to get a, an account. It would be about $100 for the year uh, with the partnership that they're able to become a premium member of P PACT, and that's $35 for the year. And because of our partnership and what we've been able to work out that they will get as an added value, as an added benefit of being a premium member, they get access to the Otis for Educator Library uh, and all that through PACT. So uh, what a, an awesome opportunity. I, I will say that We've been work trying to, you know, communicate, talk with, sit down with a lot of different companies. We had a phenomenal uh, introduction to your team at Tech uh, and specifically the Otis for Educator Group at ISTE in New mm -hmm. Orleans this past summer. Um, and yeah. that was amazing. Unfortunately, <laughs> we weren't able to make the Otis event. Maybe that'll happen this, you know, when you guys are going to be in Philly, maybe there's going to be a great, a great tech event, you know, just, uh, yeah. you know, Dom and I, you know, just put us on the list. And uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, so, um, but yeah, but we weren't able to get into that, like to have that conversation. But just on the floor, uh, I was definitely blown away with um, what you had, what you were offering. And I'm awesome. truly excited to see how our members are able to to grow, um, you know, advanced education technology for the benefit of the kids in their classroom 
uh, by, you know, sharpening their tools uh, through the courses that you provide. So it's very uh, just a, just an awesome uh, partnership. So I truly appreciate it. Yeah, of course. I'm excited to, you know, see what you guys do with it. It's I have a feeling it's it's going to be a really, really great partnership. I'm looking forward to working with some of these courses. Fantastic. And that's a lot of good topics. They said not just the tools either. You get into the pedagogy and mm-hmm. some very interesting topics. Oh, hit the wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me, so since that cut us off, I apologize there, Dom. We'll go ahead and roll. We do have a little commercial um, that um, a little Otis two minute introduction that we'll kind of play here at the end to kind of close out the night. So let me go ahead and show that. Apologize for us uh, prematurely interrupting the other thing. All right, here we go. <laughs> Remote and hybrid learning environments are quickly changing how we think about teaching and instruction. It's a challenging transition for educators, but it's also full of opportunities. How do we help educators navigate these times? How do we prepare them for these challenges and set them up for success? Meet Otis for Educators, your virtual professional development platform. We created Otis to support teachers and school leaders as they bring technology into the classroom, and it's never been as important as it is now. Whether teachers want to gain new skills, dive into specifics around remote learning, explore teaching STEM hands-on, or anything in between, Otis is the ultimate resource for educators. With over 700 courses, new live sessions each week, certification tracks, and on-demand support, your teachers and school leaders have access to a wealth of PD resources. All of our professional learning content is designed, developed, and delivered by state certified educators, ensuring you receive the most effective and relevant training possible. Otis for Educators is also a state approved PD provider, so teachers can fulfill mandated learning hours for courses taken. Otis for Educators was also built with administrators in mind and is full of features that make it easy to use and easy to implement. Administrators can view insightful usage analytics, create playlists to drive teachers to specific content, and more. Getting started with Otis for Educators is quick and easy, and we're here to help you along the way with everything from deployment to best practices for integrating Otis in your school. If you'd like to learn more about our PD platform, connect with a tech representative to discuss how to boost your professional learning experience with Otis for Educators. We're here to ensure that every teacher and school leader have the training they need to succeed. A little delayed reaction there of us getting back online. So very cool. Uh, so that that is truly awesome. I am very much looking forward to um, that work. And uh, just again, you know, just offering all those features, all those different programs to our members, uh, their ability to look up the asynchronous, to be able to do some synchronous stuff too. So definitely exciting. So any 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 final thoughts, any final questions, Dom, before we close out here? No, I think I'm good. I, I liked, you know, we went through everything. Um, Lisa covered most, if not all the questions I had. So I think we're good. Great. Thank so you I very think. much for being on. Of and course. Wonderful. Happy to be here. So I know we asked her or. The... Sorry. All right. So just real quick, put this on here. Boom. So if when uh, the program rolls out, if we have any questions, so Lisa Wren at tech with a Q, as Dom likes to say, dot com, uh, or there's an ask Otis button. I believe once you're logged in, will that appear? Where will that appear on the screen when they log in? So yeah, the, that'll live right in the lower uh, right hand corner. Ah, uh, is that right here? Here he is. Right, right down All there. Right. Okay. So they'll be able to click on that button at any time in the bottom right hand corner, and that'll immediately get channeled to the proper person as far as the question goes. So um, yeah, truly appreciate it. Thank you so much for 
coming on tonight. Um, yeah, taking time out of your day. We're so looking forward to the partnership and really appreciate it. Great. Thanks so much for having me. Uh, it was great to meet you guys, and I'm looking forward to it. Great to meet awesome. you, too. Thank you for your time. Awesome. All right. You know, and I know you were talking Pennsylvania at the beginning, and I didn't ask, what part of Pennsylvania do you live? So I actually live on Long Island, um, but we do cool. have a couple of really great reps out there in PA. Um, I'm gotcha. sure you've met them. Mark, we have Chrissy. Hopefully we'll get to, you know, have her on yeah. as well one time. All right. Well, you got some wild weather coming your way too. So yeah. make sure you stay safe. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> All right. Have a great Take night. Take care. Bye-bye guys. All right. Just amazing, man. Uh, just a, another, another great way PACTs, you know, doing as much as they can for their members. Uh, so excited for the partnership we're going to have with tech and, and using the Otis for educator platform. I know it's great premium member benefit. Um, trying to do more and more for our premium members do a lot for all members, free and premium. But this is going to be um, a game changer. There's a lot of people need Act 48. Everything is put through automatically. So you, you don't have to worry about reporting your your hours and everything like that. So That's it. a lot yeah. of good topics. Exciting stuff. All right, sir. Well, until uh, our next time we get to meet and chat and kick off the PhD pod, you have a great win over there. You know, Hold you down too. the fort in Western PA. I will have a good one over there in Eastern PA. So well, South central PA. South central. That's all good. All righty, man. All right. Have a great night. Night. All right.